Hello, my little genius. Welcome back to Reading Fun with Teacher D. Are you ready to read some new and interesting books? Yes? Okay, let's begin. The first book I'll be reading is a book about the, the diggers. It's called Where Do Diggers Sleep at Night? Where do diggers sleep at night? Do they dream of holes they dug? Do their moms reach front to back hole when they give a good night hug? Oh, look at that good night hug. Where do dump trucks sleep at night? After dumping dirt and rocks, do they gather toys and dump them in a giant truck toy box? Where do garbage trucks sleep when they're done collecting trash? Do their dad sniff their load and say, P.U. Time to take a bath? Where do monster trucks sleep when they've done a day of crushing? Do they find a giant puddle when their metal teeth need brushing? Where do fire engines sleep when they've won their firefights? Do their flashing fire red beacons make for super bright night lights? Where do snowplows sleep at night when they've cleared the snow away? Do their mom say, get to sleep boys. Lots more snow is on the way. Where do car transporters sleep when they're loaded up with cars? Do they tell those cars a story as they sleep beneath the stars? Where do tow trucks sleep at night when they've reached their destination? Do they tuck each broken car into a cozy service station? Look at the cozy service station. <gasps> Wow. Where do giant cranes sleep when they've lifted their last beams? Do their moms pick them up and rock them and wish them sweet truck dreams? Where do tractors sleep at night after plowing all day long? Do their dad sing old truck Donald? for a barnyard bedtime song? Where do all these trucks sleep after rumbling down the road? Do they gather at a truck stop to rest their heavy loads? Do they ask for one more story, one more kiss and one more hug? Do they cuddle with their teddies under blankets soft and snug? Oh, so cuddly. Where do your trucks sleep at night when it's time to go to bed? They'll be waiting in your toy box when you wake, my sleepy head. The end. Wasn't that so interesting to think of all these trucks having a bedtime like yours? Yes, I know it was. Now, we are going to be reading a story about a d -d donkey 
and I have another surprise for you. I will be singing a part of this story. So if you catch the tune of the song, feel free to sing along. But before we begin, what sound does a donkey make? If you said hee-haw, you're right. Are you ready to begin? Let's go. The Wonky Donkey. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey. He hung. And he only had three legs. He was a wonky donkey. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey. He hung. He only had three legs and one eye. He was a winky wonky donkey. He hung. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey. He hung. He only had three legs, one eye, and he liked to listen to country music. He was a Honky tonky winky wonky donkey honk. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey he honk. He only had three legs, one eye. He liked to listen to country music and he was quite tall and slim. He was a Lanky honky tonky winky wonky donkey he honk. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey he honk. He only had three legs, one eye. He liked to listen to country music. He was quite tall and slim and he smelled really, really bad. He was a Stinky dinky lanky honky tonky winky wonky donkey he honk. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey he honk. He only had three legs, one eye. He liked to listen to country music. He was quite tall and slim. He smelled really really bad. And that morning, he'd got up early and hadn't had any coffee. He was a cranky, stinky, dinky, lanky, honky, tonky, winky, wonky, donkey, he honk. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey, he honk. He only had three legs, one eye. He liked to listen to country music. He was quite tall and slim. He smelled really, really bad. That morning, he got up early and hadn't had any coffee. And he was always getting up to mischief. He was a... Hanky panky cranky stinky dinky lanky honky tonky winky wonky donkey he honk. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey he honk. He only had three legs, one eye. He liked to listen to country music. He was quite. <laughs> Get it together, teacher D. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey. He honk. He only had three legs, one eye. He liked to listen to country music. He was quite tall and slim. He smelled really, really bad. That morning, he got up early and hadn't had any coffee. He was always getting up to mischief, but he was quite good looking. 
He was a spunky, hanky, panky, cranky, stinky, dinky, lanky, honky, tonky, winky, wonky, donkey. He hung. And there's more. I was walking down the road and I saw a donkey. He hung. Wasn't that so much fun? What a very interesting donkey. Well, that's all the reading fun I have for you today. Goodbye, my little friends.